MG ZST Essence with more style. More luxury. More safety tech with 360 degree camera at 33690 drive away with all options included. The award winning MG ZST Essence is the more you've been looking for. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. Townsville's national award winning builder, Kia Constructions. Hit News Briefing. Hello, Emma Griffiths with your national briefing. It remains unclear if commuter train services in New South Wales will operate tomorrow. The union and state government have been at loggerheads over pay and conditions and it all came to a head this morning when services were cancelled. A meeting is being held today in hopes of getting the network back up and running. Alex Classens from the Rail, Tram and Bus Union says its members want to get back to it. Well, unless somebody in a decision-making capacity in government makes that call, I don't know how those trains are going to operate. Our members have been signing on duty all day today. They're on standby. They're ready to work the trains. All they need is somebody in senior management to tick the box and say, let's get these trains running again, and we're happy to do it. The Prime Minister has joined world leaders in wishing the Queen a speedy recovery after she tested positive for COVID-19. Buckingham Palace says the 95-year-old is experiencing mild cold-like symptoms. Scott Morrison is confident she's in good hands. At 95, obviously getting COVID is more of a concern than um, for, for at other age groups. And, and we wish her a full recovery. And uh, I have no doubt that she'll be taking good care of herself and she'll be getting the best of care. And US President Joe Biden and his Russian counterpart Vladimir Putin have reportedly agreed to a proposed summit on security and stability in Europe. The French president has provided the update saying the summit can only be held on the condition Russia doesn't invade Ukraine. If you spot low-hanging power lines or damage to the electricity network, call Ergon on 13 16 70 immediately so they can make it safe. To sport Australia is just over a week away from the start of the Pakistan tour. It's the Aussies' first series there since the late 90s. Batsman Manus Labashain says he's looking forward to the challenge. It's a really exciting challenge to go over there. Um, obviously very unexpected. Uh, we don't really know what we're going to get. We don't have much intel on the on the wickets apart from um, some domestic games and obviously, you know, I think 2020 South Africa toured there. And the Winter Olympics have wrapped up. Townsville the Savo heading to a max temp of 32, dropping to 24 tonight. Same conditions tomorrow with showers likely to stick around until Sunday. And our listener app is a new home of local news. Download the app now to listen live or on demand.